I've been getting questions, hey, when you're making your homemade diesel fuel, what happens if water gets mixed in? How do you separate that out? I'll show you right now. If you've ever done the oil and water experiment in school where you mix the two together and let it sit, that's essentially what this is doing. So I let it sit in here for about a week. All the oil floats to the top, all the water goes to the bottom. And then I just crack this valve, let all the water pour out, and then when I start getting oil, I'll shut it off. Simple. I can already hear the next question being, well, how do you know you got all the water out of it? If you've ever used cooking oil on the stove, when it gets hot and you flick a little water in, it bubbles. So by essentially burning some of the oil, if it doesn't bubble, meaning there's no water in it, it's just the oil burning, you know you got all the water out. And since I don't see any bubbles here, I can pump all this out into my filter into the 55 gallon drum, mix the gasoline in, and then run it in my truck.